of Russia and he faces Volodymyr Soroka of the Ukraine. The third of the uh, quarterfinals. Obligatory bow and then the uh, friendly bear hug before we get this one underway. just how nervous uh, Isaev is going to be because uh oh he goes left sided that was so quick he was in lightning fast and that's in slow motion <laughs> he, he was in so quick couldn't finish it off there blistering speed from Isayev. Just about to say, um, I wonder how nervous he's going to be because Kuzutina is from Chelyabinsk as well. And she said in the interview yesterday that uh, she just heard the crowd cheering for her and it put a bit of pressure on. And yeah, well, the arm was over the top, so Isayev could go for the leg. And. Um, oh. Then it goes, yeah. Oh, Soroka tried to pull it back off, but it was there. Yeah, so maybe the, uh, the home crowd is not always the, uh, the big advantage. Seem to uh, put that bit of pressure on Kuzutina yesterday, and she just said uh, she was aware of it. You really don't want to be aware of it, do you? You just want to get on with the job and just concentrate on that. Two minutes gone, no score yet. Isayev in the white Jadogi Soroka in uh, blue. It's the Ukrainian and the Russian doing battle here. Ochigari, a couple of goes at it from Isayev. And then, uh, yes, a nice pick up there. A leg grab, beg your pardon, nice, nice leg grab. Yeah, because Soroka attacked him with uh, Hizagaruma, or Ashigaruma, maybe Hizagaruma, I think. The leg, leg was up there, it stuck to the knee, and then um, Isayev put the leg grab in. Nice grip from the Russian. Good and high, but he gets um, attacked by Soroka, he hasn't quite settled, and that was exactly what Makarov was saying to him. Settle down. So eager to throw, isn't he, Isayev? Two minutes, 20. Good attack from Soroka. Similar looking, aren't they? Dark haired, bearded. Almost, um, you know, identical builds. Missed with that uh, Sumigai sheet. Minute 57, this is a great little battle. Palashvili and Adamic waiting in the wings, the last of the uh, contests today. As she was at Ochigari again. He's tried that a few times. The Ochi. Oh! There are going to be some um, questions there. 
I'm not sure if we'll get a replay of it because whatever they're looking at we should get to see and now they see it on the big screen <laughs> We're continuing. Talking point maybe for after in the in the uh, in the bar. Those of you that go to the bar. inside the last minute crowd just beginning to um cheer their man on here comes this i have again he's looked really positive hasn't he throughout the whole contest there goes that ochigari again soroka rocked him earlier on with one good attack missed there with his own and then that's um a rather poor effort at uh Tomoinagi. reaction from the uh, corner judges or referees re with regard to that crowd drop <laughs> <laughs> leaving it up to the fighters in the middle half a minute to go good grip now from Isaev needs the left hand on as well and oh he goes for that combination but it's uh, too late I think the leg lift here, it was so strong from the right leg, bringing the leg right up. As, that, was a, 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 that was a deliberate attack. Ooh, wasn't as strong as I thought. Just a little foot tap, wasn't it? Still, they're continuing. That wasn't, a, that wasn't the greatest of coaches before the hand went down to bring the foot up. You really, it must be really determined. Anyway, we've just got a few seconds left. And we're, maybe we're going to have more of Isaev and Soroka. Indeed. It's not over. We're going to get uh, a little bit more of this, Isaev and Soroka. Okay, we're underway with the uh, golden score period now. Couldn't come up with something, but uh, and not in Niwaza either. <laughs> this is um, all very hectic now, isn't it? What a match. <laughs> sweat, the sweat dripping of Sorica. So bothered about um, who's grabbing the leg. Why bother? Just get on with it. Forget about the leg grab. The judo, the judo's so nice. <laughs> the only time it gets ugly is when they start grabbing the legs.
Ujigari from uh, Soraka! And he throws this here for Ripon. The Ouchi from both of them. And it's the leg. The hand assist as well. Yeah, they were both on the edge with that Ouchi. And it was Soraka's Ouchi that came out on top. There's the Ochi Gari. Then he grabs the leg, the big push, putting um, Isayev onto his back. Well, the crowd in here, obviously, are desperately disappointed. They wanted to see their man go all the way. He may yet take a medal, but it won't be gold, it won't be silver. The best that um, Isayev can do now is to come back in the repechage final, win that, and, he'll, and then fight for bronze. Soraka, on the other hand, is uh, into the semi-final and he's going to face the winner of the next contest. That's uh, Yosef Pelashvili of Israel who faces Tomasz Adimech. And uh, we said earlier...